Welcome to IT Patient Enterprises Solution to Pass Question in VECE Mathematics Session B Written Year 2002 Second Sitting Question 3 IT Vision 2020 I am Lawrence Damso Amwakon Alice Kapiru in post I am going to be your facilitator. BELCE, 2002, Section B, Question 3, Second Sitting. The question is made up of three sub-questions, 3A, 3B, and 3C. I will read through the questions and pause along for their solutions. 3A. Using a ruler and a pair of compasses only, construct, I. Triangle ABC, such that AB, equals to 12 centimeters, AC, equals to 8 centimeters, and angle BAC, equals to 30 degrees. I will pause for the solution to 3A sub-question I. 3A sub-question I. We are to construct triangle ABC. We have been given the length of AB to be equal to 12 centimeters, AC to be equal to 8 centimeters, and angle VAC to be equal to 30 degrees. We shall do a rough sketch of the triangle. We shall now construct the triangle ABC. We shall start with the side AB. We shall first construct a horizontal line. We shall mark out the points A and B 12 centimeters apart on the horizontal line with the help of a ruler. We shall now construct an angle of 30 degrees to the line AB at the point A. We shall open the compass to a convenient radius. Place the tip of the compass at the point A and draw an arc to intersect the line AB. Maintaining the same radius, we shall place the tip of the compass at the point of intersection of the arc and the line AB and draw an arc to intersect the recently drawn arc. We shall place the compass at the point of intersection of the two arcs and draw an arc. Maintaining the same radius, we shall place the compass at the point of intersection of the arc and the line AB and draw an arc to intersect the recently drawn arc. We shall draw a line through the point A and the point of intersection of the two arcs. The line drawn makes an angle of 30 degrees to the line AB at the point A. Now, we are to locate the point C on this line. We have been given the length AC to be equal to 8 cm. We shall now measure 8 cm, representing the length AC with a compass and a ruler. We shall place the tip of the compass at A, draw an arc to intersect the 30 degrees line. We shall label the point of intersection of the arc and the line as C. We shall join B to C to complete the triangle ABC. Construct 3A sub question I. I. A perpendicular from C to meet AB at M. I will pause for the solution to 3A sub question I. I. 3A sub question II. We are to draw a perpendicular from C to meet the line AB at M. To do that, we shall place the tip of the compass at C and draw an arc to intersect the line AB at two points. We shall reduce the radius of the compass to a convenient size. Place the tip of the compass 
at the first point of intersection of the arc and the line AB and draw an arc. Maintaining the same radius, we shall place the tip of the compass at the second point of intersection of the arc and the line AB and draw an arc to intersect the recently drawn arc. We shall draw a line through the point C and the point of intersection of the two arcs. The line drawn is the perpendicular to the line AB at M. We shall label the point of intersection of the line drawn and the line AB as M. 3B. Measure I. Angle ABC. I. I. CM. I will pause for the solution to 3B. We are to measure the angle ABC. We shall measure the angle ABC using a protractor. We shall place the point of intersection of the 0, 180 degree line and the 90 degree line of the protractor at the point B. We shall place the 0, 180 degree line on the protractor on the line AB. As can be seen, the angle ABC is approximately 38 degrees. 3B sub question II. We are to measure the length CM. We shall measure the length CM using a ruler and a compass. We shall place the metallic tip of the compass at C and extend the pencil tip to M. We shall transfer the measurement of the compass onto a ruler. As can be seen, the length of CM equals 4 cm. 3C. Calculate the area of triangle ABC. 3C. We are to calculate the area of the triangle ABC. The area A of a triangle is given by the formula half base times height. Where B is the base of the triangle and each the height of the triangle. The area of triangle ABC is therefore equal to half magnitude of AB times magnitude of CM, where magnitude of AB equals to the base and magnitude of CM equals to the height. Magnitude of AB was given to be 12 centimeters and magnitude of CM was found to be 4 centimeters. So half times 12 centimeters times 4 centimeters, which will work down to 24 centimeters squared. So the area of the triangle ABC equals 24 centimeters squared.